Hi, my name is uh, uh, Dr. Venkatraman Sadanan. I am a pediatric neurosurgeon and uh, epilepsy surgeon based uh, in Los Angeles, California. I am actually a B.Tech graduate in electrical engineering from IIT Madras. I went on to do an MS and PhD in uh, Caltech and then did an MD at the University of Toronto in medicine, um, especially in clinical medicine. We need a little bit more than just research at the level of the bench. And when you're working in the bedside, we need innovations to come to us, not just from the bench, but somewhere in the intermediate steps as well. And that's essential. Right now, we are in a situation where in India, a lot of medical care and clinical medicine using devices and uh, materials uh, have a high cost incurred by taking and borrowing equipment from abroad. These are very expensive to buy, very expensive to maintain, and very expensive to upgrade. That needs to change. We want to progress beyond what we are doing right now. And most of the innovations in clinical medicine comes from engineering. We need the doctor to be able to think what kind of engineering solutions can help clinical medicine. And we need engineers to think how they can contribute to the progress of clinical medicine. I'm Dr. Ajit Mulisheri, Director of Cardiology at the Madras Medical Mission. Very happy to be associated as Madras Medical Mission with IIT Madras for the BS Medical Sciences uh, program at the IIT. I think this will be a great platform for uh, the passing of graduates to work in hospitals, in departments which are clinical and they would be uh, exposed to a lot of the medical technology, patient care and adapt it to use it for products and uh, uh, licenses so that we can build infrastructure in this country for uh, delivering better health care. I think this is a great opportunity for hospitals to collaborate with institutes like IIT which are uh, basically uh, engineering uh, excellent centers to produce a graduate which who has the best of both so he can provide the best of healthcare transformation in this country. Congratulations to the IIT Madras for starting this uh, wonderful uh, BS course in medical sciences and engineering. There has been a long-standing uh, need in this country. Uh, engineers and doctors have been in their own world and the integration between the two has really never happened. Unless we take special interest, it never happens. So this particular course where the engineers are going to get exposed to various medical uh, branches, the medical line of thinking, at the same time with an engineering mind, I think would make a great difference. I think this will be a stepping stone of a new specialty in this country. The realm of cardiology and cardiac surgery has made immense strides in the last few decades. We struggled with doing safe procedures and surgeries to now being able to do very safe procedures in very sick patients. But all this has been possible due to the technological advances of engineering. It is, the time is ripe now for medicine and uh, engineering to come together and take things to a different level. And that is where the BS program in medical science and technology comes in. We are uh, privileged to have a set of doctors and engineers working together to make things much better, safer and less invasive for patients. And that means better outcomes and we have a very exciting future in this field. I would like to congratulate Professor Kamkoti and the team of IIT for putting up such a nice course, an interdisciplinary course, the need for the day. I think the uh, students who will pass this course of BS in medical science, there's a unique course, a unique course in the country. I think none other course, you have such a mixture of engineering stream and the doctor stream. Today, 
we are in the time where technology and medicine have really immersed together and uh, a doctor cannot practice medicine alone without use of technology in field of medicine and now we are ready to prepare a manpower who can take this to greater heights we will have innovations from india this is first of its kind in india and i'm sure this course would really be a successful program this is uh, dr karthik kailash uh, the head and uh, professor and head of uh, department of spine surgery at the sri ramachandra institute uh, we are very glad to hear about this course and uh, be a part of it uh, this course is a boon for uh, many many youngsters who have got aspirations into uh, doing uh, newer and uh, lateral thinking projects additionally uh, this is going to be uh, engineering medicine and which is going to be the key game changer for most of the young youngsters in this part of the world i'm very happy to know that the uh, iit madras is starting a bs in medical sciences i feel this is a very important course because it is bringing uh, engineering and medicine together and when we see uh, engineers working inside a medical environment it's going to make a big change in not only uh, creating new new talent but also make sure that innovations are much more oriented towards the bed side so from bench to bed side has always been a challenge in any medical innovation <clears throat> but this will probably help us to bridge that gap and bring uh, bench to bed side much faster if not today tomorrow there will be a day when each one of us you and i will be in a hospital not as a caregiver but as a patient at that time what would you like that question is being answered by iit madras they have started a beautiful program with a bachelor's degree in what is going to be called as medical sciences and engineering this is the answer to that question what would you like to see in your hospital in which you are a patient a little while from now this beautiful program in the undergraduate level is a four year program in which the curriculum has been very carefully crafted about half of your curriculum will be in a hospital setting in a clinical setting and half will be in an engineering institution like iit this top institution has tailored the courses to be relevant for clinical medicine this is the first such program in this country in india it is also the second program in the world to do this the world is watching and each one of you who joins this program will be part of this extremely innovative and creative development in the field of both medicine and engineering